Hey guys, welcome to my video. For today's tutorial, I will be teaching you how to make the invisible double crochet increase. To begin, all you're going to need is some yarn and a crochet hook. For this tutorial, you will need to know how to make chains, how to make the double crochet stitch, and how to work in the back loops. I have videos on all those and I will have them listed down below. I have already made this little test swatch here using two different colors, so it's going to be easy to see how the stitch is going to be made. I will have the yarn that I'm using and the hook that I'm using listed down below. For the body of my test swatch, I used regular double crochet stitches. And on the row that I'm currently working, I have already made three chains on my hook. So into the first stitch, I'm going to make a regular double crochet. And now I'm ready to make my first invisible increase. You're going to make a double crochet into the next stitch, but only work it into the back loop, which is this loop right here. So it's going to look like this. Work that regular double crochet into it. That's how that's going to look. Then into that same stitch, you're going to work a double crochet, but like you would normally into this spot right here. And that is going to be an invisible increase. So you're working two double crochet into that same stitch, but it's going to be worked into different areas. And it's an invisible increase compared to a regular one because it's going to leave less of a gap between your stitches. All right, in the next one, I'm going to work a regular double crochet by itself. I'm ready to make a new increase. Work the next double crochet into the back loop of that next stitch. Then work a regular double crochet like normal into that stitch. Make a regular one in the next. Another invisible increase. Work a double crochet into the back loop of your next stitch. Then work a double crochet into this same stitch like normal. And that's how those are looking. I'm going to make a regular one in this next stitch. Another invisible increase. Insert your hook into the back loop of that next stitch working a regular double crochet. Then make a regular double crochet into that same stitch like normal. I'm going to make a regular double crochet in the next one. And I'm going to continue to alternate between these for the rest of my row. You can now see from my swatch that this row is much bigger than the other rows that I had made. My swatch is now getting wider because we are increasing. And that's going to be how to make the invisible double crochet increase. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Please like and subscribe for more from me. You can follow me on all social media at crochet me lovely, all one word. Please leave me any feedback down below for future videos and tutorials that you would like to see. Thank you guys so much for being here and have a great day.